Good morning, Mark Sconti reporting. Oh, 58 degrees. Excuse me. 48 degrees. It's Marathon Sunday again. <laughs> There's the bridge, Verrazano Bridge. That's the starting line on the Staten Island side. New York City Marathon. Here we go, here we go. So I'm going to take a walk through, right? Plenty of police. <laughs> going to walk over there so every year here we are New York City Marathon it's the uh, race that goes through all five boroughs of New York you're in Bay Ridge Brooklyn right now right, that's where I am Bay Ridge all right this is actually the walk in Saturday Night Fever right John Travolta comes out I think of the subway over there out of the subway and he walks along this block and he goes into the cafe right there right it's not a cafe anymore. It's not a uh, diner anymore. It's now a uh, car dealership. But nonetheless, very historic Brooklyn, New York. Brooklyn, New York. So we're going to see the start of the race. We'll see the... Um, I think the wheelchairs have already started. We'll see the professional women. And we'll see the, uh, the, the men, the pro men. Uh, come spinning around the turn so the favorite I think for the women is uh, Maria Catani Maria Catani the uh, Kenyan runner Kenyan runner can I slip under and go through yeah thank you plenty of police oh <sighs> so I think I'm on the track right now so you notice this is a There'll be no action until for another hour or so up here. <laughs> you just got to be cautious when you cross a police line. So it's pretty. Uh, it's a pretty interesting setup. It's again no. There's no. Uh, no nothing really going on right now. But I love running. What the hell am I doing out here, right? The fuck am I covering a running event? Because. In 2000, I think it was uh, 1981 or 82. I was 19 years old, and I ran the, I ran this race in uh, three hours, 44 minutes, 10 seconds. I got a picture to prove it. <laughs> and uh, I remember doing it. I remember, I remember, I remember running it and and preparing for it. it took about a year or two to get ready for it. And I remember after I was done, I said, I'll never do that again. <laughs> I said, it's just not, it's not, it's not natural. You know what I mean? It's not, it's not organic to, to run 26 miles for no reason. I mean, I, I would run if I were chased, but uh, I still run now. I think it's important. I remember running, I haven't run in a few days, but I remember running the other day. And I, I remember saying... Every day I run, when I run, when I exercise, it's a better day, right? If I start the day off running, you know, two miles, a mile, two miles, three miles, doesn't have to, you don't have to go out and kill yourself. I, I, I think to myself, wow, it was a better day. I don't know why, it was just, well, I do know why, because it's just better. It's a better day, because you exercised. I still feel that way. So, so here we are. So you got some, uh, got a dog over there. So this is the, this is the uh, path right here. This is the active course. You got some bikers. Right. Coming on, coming around the turn. And they make that turn right there, right? It's pretty exciting. Okay. 
So we're looking for also the men. Um, the world record holder, they already broke two hours for the marathon, you heard? So the course has been shattered. The the, wor the world record for the marathon, two hours, imagine. That's like 456, 457 a mile. It's just crazy. I mean, crazy. It's crazy fast. I ran it about 830 a mile. So what I'm saying is every day you run. It's just a better day. I don't know. Exercise, eat right, do a little meditation, right? And then you'll be, you know, one day you'll be, you'll be in your fifties, and you'll have as, uh, you know, beautiful hair like I do. Right? It's amazing, right? You'd never think that, you know, at fifty years old you would have such beautiful. Look how beautiful my hair is. Did you see how beautiful my hair is? It's unbelievable, right? I can't believe. I, I wake up in the morning. I say, how did I? How was I so lucky? Like. I don't have much, but man, is my hair beautiful? Everybody says, "Oh, you got a wig." It's a, is it's that's a wig attached to your to your to your to your hat. It's a hat wig. It's fucking no hat wig. It's beautiful, beautiful hair. Beautiful hair. <laughs> so, so oh, this is about the uh, mile and a half to mile mark. That's all it is, really. And uh, I'll try to move up a little bit. I think uh, I don't like this spot. I don't know if I like this spot. Uh, maybe. See the women come by. They come by in a flash. you got to be paying attention. They're like gazelles. Ah, so the, the chance of an American winning today is probably slim to none. The Kenyans have dominated the sport. That's because in Kenya they run away from the lions, you heard? <laughs> they spend their whole lives running away from lions and tigers. It's stomped on by elephants, man. You gotta run your ass off. That's how you get that's how they train. They train running away from the lions in Kenya. So many police. So many police on the scene. So many police. Oh, that's a good spot. Nah, maybe I'll stay up here. So, this would be a good spot to watch. So, here come the lead women. Lead women. Wow, here they come. They're like gazelles. You see them? So, reporting live from the uh, New York City Marathon, 48 degrees here in New York. Lead runner we'll be looking for is uh, uh, Mary Katani, Maria Katani, the uh, the uh, Kenyan runner. Time is 12:53. So they're uh, just about they're just before the two mile mark, and you can see them coming over the hill right now. And here they come. Go, 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 go. And there they go. There's some more women. There they come. for the men. Wait for the men to come in. Here come the men way out in the distance. Oh my god, they're on the bridge. There they are in Bay Ridge, Brooklyn, the elite men. The elite men ready to come screaming down the road. And there they are, you can see them off in the distance. I hope nobody jumps in front of me and takes my shot. 
Trying not to get hit by a cop car. All that stuff. So there you go. The time is 11.08. 11.09, 11.10. That's the lead car. I'm just going to step out of the way of these motorcycles because these guys are nasty. And they will run you over. And there they are. There are the many elite runners. They are motoring away. And there's our men leaders. Come around and turn. So he has a couple other men chasing. There's all the white guys. <laughs> There's all the white guys. They're chasing the black guys. The, see the white guys chasing the black guys. Ooh, hope they catch him. Those are homos. Like I said the last time, I said earlier, I ran this race once. I said to myself, never again. 26 miles. These are all fast runners right here. This is no joke. 